Josiah, I mean, you, obviously you sat for a long period in the, in the, in the first half. It seems like it might have been tough to you know, cool off and come back in, but you started so quick. Did, were you feeling it, you know, shooting at, at halftime? When did you kind of realize that, hey, I've got something going? Um, nothing really felt different. Um, I, yeah, I was a little cold. I got stretched during halftime, but um, I mean, those are shots that I practice, and so I just trust my work, trust my teammates, and credit to them. They, um, Uroch and Brandon were screening to get me open. Zakai, Kennedy, Santi were passing it, um, putting it on the money, and so I mean, all the shots felt good. But credit to my teammates. Raise your hand if you have other questions. I'm going to stay on the front row. Go ahead. Is this game a testament to the backcourt depth with Kennedy dealing with a injury? And y'all still score and find ways to produce? That question was for who? Well, pick one. Thank you. I'd say, yeah. Um, our, men our mentality throughout the year is always next man up because you never know what's going to happen. And um, we're thankful that Kennedy's doing well, um, that he's, he's OK. But uh, we, we had faith in whoever was going to come in. It just happened to, to be Zakai and JP. They got a lot of the minutes. Um, but we knew that uh, no production was, there was going to be no production drop off because we practice and play against each other each and every day. So we were prepared. Next question over on the left side. Zakai, I'm sure you've become so accustomed to playing alongside Kennedy and alternating with him. With, did anything change for you when he was kind of out trying to work that ankle out a bit? Uh, honestly, no, because I already knew, it was, just like Josiah said, it was next man up. So I'm just always prepared as long as my other teammates. So I just always knew to be ready. Raise your hand, other questions? Let's, uh, let's go ahead and get on the far side, and then we'll come back to the center aisle. Zakai, Iverson Molinar had nine points for them in the first half, only one on, on 0 of 3 shooting, and, or 0 of 6 shooting, I should say, in the second half. How much of a point of emphasis was he kind of slowing him down to slowing out the rest of this offense? Uh, we knew if we contained him that it would be make the game easier for all of us. So my mindset was just take him out the game. That's all I was thinking. OK, question on the front row center aisle. Go ahead. Josiah, Zakai, and Kennedy had 14 assists and just one turnover. What's it like playing with those two when they just have complete feel for the game? It's fun. Um, I get, I'm thankful and grateful that I get to play with, with all my teammates, but it's specifically those guys because they just make the game so easy uh, for everybody around them. So yeah, it's, it's a lot of fun playing with them uh, when they're playing their best basketball. Question down here on the front row. Zakai, you guys talked a lot about how much faith you had in Josiah earlier in the season when his shots weren't falling. What's it like seeing that run today where he hits four straight three-pointers? Oh, it was great. I was jumping all around, um, waving in the air. I felt like I was making the shots. Uh, I just I just love seeing all my teammates do that, and especially him. Once he was knocking all them down, I, I felt like I was doing all that. So that's all it was. The, the, uh one you shot the air ball to slip. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I don't think we're going to talk about that one. Next play. <laughs> Next one's going, man. That's right. Yo, tonight, 10 points. Uh, it seemed like he was a force in there with John Fulkerson. What is it about him? What does he bring to the game, especially this type of situation in the tournament? It's his mentality. When he, when he wants to play physical, and when he's playing at his best and imposing his will, I mean, it's really hard to stop him. I know firsthand because I have to guard him. And so we're just, uh, I'm happy to see him, him, him grow throughout the year. Uh, the way he's playing right now is really what we need. And um, it's no surprise to us. Um, but when he really puts his mind to it and tries to impose his will, th those are the, the results that we get. Was there a hand in the way back? OK, we're good. We got time for one or two more. OK, let's go to the back on the left. Josiah, you've been shooting the ball well for the last three or four games, not just tonight. Um, is it just one of those things in a rhythm, superstition, eating the same thing for breakfast? Just what is it lately? Just trusting in my work um, and trusting my, and my teammates having faith in me, my coaches having faith in me. I mean, they give me the, the utmost confidence. Um, those guys and everybody in the locker room are always telling me to shoot uh, the next one, the next one's going in. And I truly believe that. And so I just say trusting in my teammates and trusting in my work because I, I put the time in. And so I think it's going to pay off. I have time for one more, anyone? All right, we'll take the last one on the right. JJJ, what do you prefer more, hitting those threes, or do you prefer getting a stop on the defensive end? Mm. I can answer that for you. He likes to win. He likes to win. Exactly. <laughs> okay, that's as long, whatever helps us get the, get the win in the win column, that's all I care about.